Hey guys, how's it going? Diamond Rush here, and today, guys, I'm here for a tutorial for you guys. Um, Mr. Cookie asked me to make how well asked me how to set up a bucket server. Now, this is a bucket slash spigot because you download spigot, then you pass it to bucket. I don't know; it's a little bit complicated for me. My head gets I get a headache because of this. Okay, so first thing you guys want to do is go to the first link and download this, which is the WinRAR. You're gonna need WinRAR, um, and you want to extract this. So there we go. I'm not going to show you guys how to port forward or anything like that because really I don't know how. So um, you want to get this file and you want to make another file with however you want to name it. So I'm going to name this server. Wow, I'm so creative. Okay, so you want to open this up and here, here you find everything you're going to need. So to this file right here, you want to put the craft bucket, the EULA and the run. Now, guys, um, normally a lot of people have cracked Minecraft, so you want to go to edit and you want to change this true to false. And these numbers here, 1024, you guys change that however you want to. This is basically one gigabyte of RAM I'm giving to the server. And if you guys want to change that like to half a gigabyte, just go ahead. Nobody's stopping you. So you want to pass every file. So let me. Let me get here, this here as well. And in the plugins, I set up a little bit of a few plugins for you guys. Basically, World Edit, Vault, Permission X, Essentials Chat, Essentials, I'm sorry if I say this wrong, Essentials, and a Clear Lag. Uh, I left a bit of permissions for you guys if you guys wanted it. So here it is. If you guys want it, go ahead. I'm only going to keep uh, Clear Lag. Yeah, that's the best one. Okay. So, oh wait, don't, don't put it in yet. Sorry, guys. So don't put that in. There we go. Stay there. Okay. So after you got all that, you can put this to the side. You can delete this if you want, but I'm going to keep it. So open up your server file and you want to start, well, run this. Now, guys, if you haven't ever read the EULA, um, just go on this link here and read it. I already read, so I'm not going to go through that. But just click run if you read it. And all you have to do is wait. It's going to be processing a few files, so I'll be back when this is done. All right, so the files are done being proceed well created at least. So you want to just do the following command here on the CMD. You want to put stop. So there you have it. It's stopping. Just give it a second. Yeah, this. Oh, there we go. So there we go. Here's your server. That's basically all you need. If you guys want to change like these files here, you can like name them. Um, but yeah, the most important right now is this server. You want to open that up. So let me throw this away, and let me yeah this is good enough so the most important thing here is server IP you want to get your IP and put it there now if you don't know your IP all you have to do is go in the CMD right here CMD and go here and put in IP config and where it says IP4 address you guys want to get that but I'm not gonna show mine sorry um, so if you guys still don't want to know your if you well if you haven't found your IP I'm um, just put in local host there we go like that and basically have all these options message of the day so I'm gonna put here um, let me think the lag is whoop, nope is real XD there we go smiley face um, so that's basically it. you can change the world name but I'm gonna keep that the same and I'm gonna save this so now you can close it down, open up your server, and in the plugins, you guys basically add the plugins that you want. So I gave you guys some plugins if you want to put it in, go ahead. I'm just going to put this one in. And yeah, that's basically how you make it. And let's hop into Minecraft and see how this works. All right, we are in Minecraft. So basically, you want to go to multiplayer. You want to or direct connect and put in local host. Or if you don't want to do that like every time, you just add a server, name it whatever you want. So I'm going to name this YTF. There we go. That's awesome. So here you want to put the uh, server, I, server address. So that's either the IP or just type in local host. There we go. So done. Uh, I changed the message, so sorry about that. So if you enter, you basically have a generated world. But I already started doing a couple things, so... Let's see if this loads up correctly, and there you have it. 
I added plugins, sorry guys. But yeah, that's basically how it works, guys. Um, thanks a lot for watching. If you guys, if this helped you out with anything, please give a like. If you like the video, subscribe to join my awesome galaxy today. And yeah, guys, I got a lot of work to do in this server. And I guess, perhaps, maybe, I'll see you guys next time. I'm out.